I've just really enjoyed, you know, my squash for the last 25 years. Squash is a sport actually is a very limited life, you know, it's a very short period in your life where you can really do a lot and I still feel like, you know, I have more to give, more to give the game and more more laurels to achieve. Namaskar, Shangbat Putin dot in a shakolka shagoto, Amade Shangirochen, squash player, Josna Chinapa. Takeni tar Puricha and Utunkura Dawar Kichuni, to Amrachulajapa Tashate Tar Bhubishot Purikal Punaibung, Uti Dine struggle from Porkejante, to Amade Shangirochen, Josna. Hi Josna. Hello. Uh, the first question for you that you are a, a big name in um, Indian and Asian squash for a long time, like 20 years. So, what is the the secret behind our really long career of you uh, firstly thank you very much um, so I started my career when I was uh, 10 years old and I've been playing the junior circuit since I was 11 years old and I decided very early on that this was going to be my career, squash was going to be my career and my parents were very very supportive of it. Of course I had to finish school and uh, college as well but the minute I turned 19 I went professional so I play on the pro tour and honestly I've just really enjoyed you know my squash for the last 25 years. I, I probably train harder today than I did uh, before. Um, squash is a sport actually is a very limited life you know it's a very short period in your life where you can really do a lot and I still feel like you know I have more to give more to give the game and more more laurels to achieve and I guess that's why my career has been so long yeah that's you just said uh, that squash is a limited game and uh, back then 25 years ago it was really a rare game just uh, a pastime for some really big shots. So what was the problems you faced in your early days? Uh, you know, like you said, back then squash was not very well known and there was not much support from the government. So my parents are really the reason that I've been able to play, especially in my you know formative years. They helped me play a couple of junior tournaments. I would win that. So that would give me some recognition, some support from like one or two sponsors. But ultimately, um, I always I chose that this was going to be my career, and I and I worked really hard. I trained hard, so when I started doing well in the international tournaments, that's when slowly, you know, the support started coming in um, from the government. And of course, it helps when you win medals for um, for the country at you know the Commonwealth Games, Asian Games, and I think that really helped me get more support from the government. Okay, so uh, now, how it's changed in. Uh this 25 years the game itself and in India and the world basis so back then when I started a lot of the players I competed with they all went to America to study because uh, American colleges the Ivy League colleges you know they give scholarship financial aid for squash players to come in and study in America and most of them went there because you know it's job security you're getting a good you know quality education and I was probably one of the few people me and Saurabh Goshal who from that generation that really wanted to play for India and play professional but today um, there are so many more squash players who are very interested in you know playing for India going professional I think the awareness is a lot more today and I just hope that they can also be you know financially supported and you know given uh, all the support and encouragement needed so that they can play for India and play professional Okay, um, you are talking about uh, Shodab Ghoshal, uh, he's uh, our local boy, local hero and the, you Shodab and Deepika Pallikar, you, the trio bring a lot of glory to India, so what about this trio? Indian squash. I mean, Saurav is, you know, obviously a legend of the game. Um, he has, uh, he's also similar to me in many ways. We've had a very long career. We started at the, you know, at the same time. We went to school together. So, and Deepika obviously has been my doubles partner for the longest time. I've also known her before she started playing squash as a five-year-old. So, you know, I go way back with both these, uh, bo both of them. And they've obviously achieved, you know, some incredible things uh, in their career. Um, of course, Saurav, you know, he's the top 20, uh, you know, player in the mm. world. He's he's my age. We're both 36 and like, you know, uh, but we still obviously, uh, you know, have a lot more to do. We have the Asian Games coming up. So we're all really preparing for that. So uh, will you please elaborate about the Asian Games, Jim? 
Uh, well, actually, the Asian Games, as you know, were supposed to be last year, but they got postponed to a, a year later. So now it's happening in, in China in, in September. And uh, it's another six, seven months, you know, for the Games. So, of course, like we're all preparing. We have a lot of tournaments to play before that. We have about six, seven tournaments. And, and hopefully we can get some good training in as well over the next six months. Okay. Thank you, Josna. Thank you. Mother Shanga Chil and Josna Chinapa, Tini Amada Shanga Share Kolentar, Uti Diner Kothai Bong Bhushotar Podikalpona, Camera Shubru, Bondopata Shanga, Amishila Jit Sharkar, Shangwat Sutin Dotin.